relief to businesses that would have otherwise experienced uh, really significant spikes in their unemployment insurance rates as a result of the COVID-19 emergency. We know that this pandemic has caused uh, sweeping economic hardship uh, for workers and businesses. And this bill is a big step forward to softening those impacts. It is not the only thing we're doing. As you know, we previously had done uh, uh, tens of millions of dollars of relief for businesses, and I am fairly confident there will be more forthcoming. Senate Bill 5061 both increases the minimum unemployment benefits for workers and provides $1.7 billion in unemployment tax relief for businesses across the next five years. It makes policy changes for addressing future public health crises based on what we have learned during the past year. The bill passed with strong bipartisan support. I'd particularly like to thank Senator Kaiser for her work in developing this legislation in the beginning, and Senator King and Representative Sells, who worked across the aisle to educate members to make sure we could get this bill across the finish line. And I'm very happy we've done this early in the session because this relief certainly is needed. We, we need the business to have confidence. I'd also like to acknowledge the hard work of the Employment Security Department and the Unemployment Insurance Advisory Committee comprised of businesses and worker representatives. They work closely together on this proposal, and I'd like to thank all legislators and legislative staff for their regular engagement with the public. They uh, fielded an unprecedented number of inquiries from businesses and workers in this difficult time. So I'd like to uh, uh, first invite Senator Kaiser for some comments. Senator Kaiser. Thank you, Governor. Thank you so much. Thank you for your staff work on this as well. It's been a joint effort for all parties to get this bill to your desk, and I want to thank everybody involved. This is going to not only address a really immediate crisis for so many of our businesses, but it will also build a good, solid bridge to the future so that we maintain a healthy trust fund and are able to continue to pay benefits. And it isn't just numbers we're talking about. It's real people, tens of thousands of real people who are unemployed and thousands of business owners who are facing, were facing really high increases in their unemployment insurance premium taxes. Those will now be able to be reduced for April the first quarter of the year that they're due. And that's one of the reasons why it was so important to get this bill to your desk early enough. So once again, I want to thank you. We have a lot left to do, but this is a huge step forward. Thank you, Senator Kaiser, for pushing this uh, early. And uh, this is very much a bipartisan success. We're great to have bipartisan success here in Washington State. So I'm looking forward to comments from Senator King. Well, thank you, Governor. I appreciate uh, the opportunity to be with you today, and and thank you so much for pushing putting this bill forward, uh, and all of your staff and your efforts uh, in regards to trying to help our many businesses that have been struggling uh, so mightily uh, just to keep their doors open. I also want to thank Senator Kaiser for her willingness to to allow me to join her in working on this bill uh, as we moved it forward. I want to say that it's it's a great first step. Uh, I think there's more work to do, and uh, the good senator and I have talked about how we might be able to continue uh, to aid our businesses and look forward uh, to those discussions and doing more. But uh, thank you today for signing this bill, uh, and look forward to working with you again as we move forward to uh, to help uh, our businesses across the state. Senator King, look forward to more bipartisan success. And we have a great uh, uh, advocate for working families for so many years who's now helped uh, make sure this helped working families as well as businesses, and that's Representative Sells. Representative. Well, thank, thank you very much, uh, Governor. And uh, thank you, uh, Senator Kaiser and uh, Senator King for your work in the Senate. Uh, you made it a lot more easy for us to move things uh, through the House. Not totally easy, but it was easy enough to, to get it through because of the bipartisan work over in the Senate. As uh, Senator King has said, and Senator Kaiser said, we know we have more to do. We have lots more to do. 
and we will be working on those within the next couple of weeks. You'll see some more bills coming out. We know that you, we've teed up in this bill administrative work to try to make the system a little more efficient and a little more quick. And lastly, uh, Governor, uh, I would be remiss if I didn't thank our legislative assistants who during this whole pandemic took calls that would break your heart. And they struggled through and we worked with the system. We were able to move some, not as quickly as we like, but we made it better than it probably would have been. This bill does the same thing and I look forward to continued work on it. Thank you, and I uh, add uh, my thanks to your staff as well as ours who've been worked on this. With this, I'm signing Senate Bill 5061 very happily. And we not we just made some good law in the state of Washington. Good luck to all businesses and workers. Thank you very much.